the Enforcement Directorate has arrested Ratul Puri, MP Chief Minister Kamal Nath's nephew in connection with a Rs 354 crore bank fraud case. The ED arrested Puri, the former Executive Director of Mozabair, after the Central Bureau of Investigation last week filed an FIR against him, his father and Mozabair Managing Director Deepak Puri, Directors Neeta Puri, Sanjay Jain, Vineet Sharma and others for defrauding the Central Bank of India of Rs 354 crore. They were all booked for alleged criminal conspiracy, cheating, forgery and corruption after a complaint from Central Bank of India. Prime Minister Narendra Modi and US President Donald Trump discussed bilateral trade between the two countries during a 30-minute long telephonic conversation yesterday. PM Modi also voiced his concerns over the extreme rhetoric and incitement to anti-India violence by certain leaders in the region, calling it a hindrance to peace. During the conversation, PM Modi recalled his meeting with President Trump on the sidelines of G20 summit in Osaka in June earlier this year. Accusing India of waging fifth-generation warfare, Pakistan said yesterday New Delhi had failed to inform it about the release of water from a dam that could cause flooding across the border. India, however, rejected the claim, saying that under the terms of a water treaty between the two nations, it had informed Pakistan about the release of excess water late on Monday when it crossed a certain threshold. Relations between the neighbours, already hostile, have been further strained over India's decision this month to revoke the special status of its portion of the Kashmir region. Amazon India has long been eyeing the food delivery business in India. As per market reports, the e-commerce giant's prime membership plan had logged more than 10 million users in the country in 2018. Amazon is confident that the addition of a food delivery segment to its prime offering will not only bring in more daily users, but also boost the number of transactions. People aware of the company's plans told the Times of India that Prime Now, Amazon's two-hour grocery delivery platform, could be the primary vehicle for its foray into food delivery business in India. Global card payments group Visa is critical of the Indian government's decision to boost adoption of electronic payments by requiring banks and card payment networks to offer no-fee debit card transactions, a senior Visa executive said. Last month, India's Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman said that businesses with annual turnover of 500 million rupees will not have to pay a merchant discount rate on debit card and other digital modes of transactions, excluding credit cards. The United States Ambassador to India has written to top American technology firms, assuring them of support for a level playing field in India. Kenneth Juster last month wrote to the heads of leading US technology companies in India, urging them to participate personally in discussions with government officials in New Delhi on data localization and e-commerce. Mm -hmm.